Welcome back to Ram Survival. Yay. So, I've been grinding it up. Well, the fishing. Look at my levels. You see that? 51 levels. 51. I finally had enough, got enough sand to finish making the concrete powder to build up the house and put the windows in. And I think there's a couple things on the checklist for the build that aren't on, that aren't finished yet, but that's okay because we are pretty much done building the house. Yay! Yay, 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 yay. Okay. So in three, two, one, boom. Before the, the there was a roof, but no walls. So we've got walls up. I even started working on the kitchen area a little bit over here. Got like an island with uh, some countertops, a stove. I was organizing my stuff. So we've got, po I think that's this, like potion stuff. This is food stuff. Got wood dirt gravel which you can see here this is something that I'm going to do off camera because it is kind of boring to put this through the the sieve all right and then so I've got all that stuff I got some organized Lots of extra things here and the upstairs which I'm so excited it all has walls and uh, this is my chest wall over here, so we've got storage. And then out here on the, like the decking porch thing, we've got a nice view of the water. So one thing that I've thought about doing is putting like a garden back over here behind me, uh, doing some and potatoes and carrots and beetroot and just food in general we're gonna just start up a farm and when I come back we'll we'll see about you know getting more farms involved I think that's what I'm gonna try to do today I think that's gonna be the longest part is not only sifting through all that gravel but also placing all the dirt to to have the land to put the things on like that's gonna be taking me the longest is putting all the dirt down and I'll come back when I finish doing all that and then we'll go on like a little adventure we'll see how many gold nuggets we can get from sifting all that gravel and we'll go down like you can kind of see one right behind me over my shoulder there's a little villager dude down there and we're gonna get some of our potions and we're gonna go underwater and we're gonna start trading for some stuff hopefully we'll find some good trades worth trading for but until then i'm gonna work on uh putting all the dirt back here yeah working all that dirt so i'll see you in a little bit okay so we're back I'm almost done. I figure I'll come back and let you watch me do this last little boring bit around this, just around this corner of the island off to the whole big farmland area over there. And you can tell the grass is growing in very quickly. I'm amazed at how fast it's growing. The, the tick on the growth tick is definitely increased in this game. Okay. Down a little bit this way. Yep. That looks good. Nice little curve. There we go. 
got kind of like a pond here. And it should be enough space. There might not be enough. I might have to add more room for farm, for more farm space over here. What do you have to sell, dude? Slime balls. I'm not sure if I want to pay four emeralds for one slime. But that's the only use for, for emeralds that I have seen so far. So I've left this open because I've been really, I've been fishing right out those doors right there. And I've really been enjoying that. The ease of fishing right out there. So I'm thinking maybe I'll just build like a little dock, a little deck coming off that. And then this way I can still continue to fish and, and have the ability to, you know, have this little thing here and have a nice view. So that's, that's what we're going to work on. I do have some dirt left over. I need to put some pressure plates down for these doors to make it easier for me to be getting in and out. Oh yeah, here's here's the, the sifter, the sieve. I put it up there. I haven't done that yet, I'll be honest. But we will. grass for, or the, the leaf blocks are for the water sources for the garden. So, we want to make a decking, docking area, a little deck dock area. Alright, um, I think we're using jungle for that. So let's use the jungle still. What's the railing? I think I use for fence, for the fence post as a birch, right? Yeah, I'll do that. I should have some birch, some birch fence posts. I think that might be just enough. Let's see. Make a couple more slabs. A nice little space to uh, fish off, fish off of. Uh, make it come down like so. Hmm. Is this all I want to do? Just that? Maybe. I don't know if I like that. Maybe I will put that to the window. Go. Oops, I dropped it. I dropped it. Can I drop that one too? Okay. So this is why I didn't want to go to the window. I didn't want the fence in front of the window. Maybe I'll just go. To the window or to these tall windows. I don't want to do too much. Ah! <laughs> I fell in. I also need to put a ladder. I want to put like an escape route or an escape entrance inside the house so that if I have another pillager incident, I can escape through, have an escape of some sort. Maybe a hole that goes down into the uh, water so I can swim away. All right. Definitely gonna to need to make more fence. And slabs. Let's go. This is my area is coming along so nice. 
Islands. I was thinking about, should I have a name for the island? Like, what should I call it? Hmm. Do I just leave it like this? Or should I put something, like some type of a face on it? I have stairs, John. I think I have some stairs. I'll try and experiment. Let's see. Try a little experiment. Let's see how this looks. Always gotta be testing out new things. space to fish. Let's see. Okay. Perfect. All right. That's, that'll be good. That'll work. put something on the bottom. What should I do for the bottom? I kind of want to break it up instead of doing all this con these uh, this uh, cobblestone. Maybe it'll look good to have it like this. Look like a leg. Make some supports. too bad. No, oh, that looks good. I like it. Alright. Sun's going down. I'm going in sleep. You know what? I can make pressure plates right before the sun goes down. I bet you just enough time to do that. for the porch. And jungle for the house. There we go. Ooh. Just enough time to make them and go to sleep. Bam. So now we can open and we can go through the door without having to worry about closing them behind us. Yay. in a little bit. That was funny how they opened up different directions. Torches down all over. Oh, okay. So I have a stack of torches on me. You know what? I should start making lanterns. We have so much iron. Look, look, this one. Look at all this iron. I have 17 ink nuggets, 40 ingots. I got 40 ore and 27 iron blocks. And I'm running around without underwear on. I mean, armor on. <laughs> I'm running around without armor on. So, 
let's start making some lanterns. Doesn't look too bad. I need to make some some chains too to be able to hang them. Like if I could hang one here, this would be adorable. So I think we had talked about after we put the grass down. We're going to try to trade with the, I don't even know what they're called. I know that they are villager type thing, but they're not really villagers. What are they mermen villagers or something? And this is how we get the nuggets to trade. But there we go, there's one. And this takes a while. Ooh, I'm getting diamonds and emeralds. Iron, flint, lapis. Look at all these goodies. It's going to take a while. So, I will come back when I'm finished with, what is this? I have about three stacks now. These three stacks, when I'm done. Take a short minute. Okay, so now we're back. And let's see what we got from those three stacks. Oh man, we have almost a stack and a half of flint. Pretty much a stack of coal, three diamonds, 10 lapis, two emeralds, 39 gold nuggets. And I know I had some iron nuggets already, so I know, I'm not gonna count all 49. But that's not a bad haul. 39 gold nuggets. Let's hope that's enough to trade with some of the, uh, the merman villagers. Let's put, just in time for nightfall too. Put some of this away that we don't need. I think we're going to be able to trade um, wheat. So I'm going to take a stack. And I don't know what else to trade. I know that that's one trade is the wheat. But we'll gather up a few potions this time. Let me put the lanterns away too. Ooh, my iron axe is almost broken. So I should definitely like gear up before we go. We'll take three potions with us this time. So we have our weapon, our food, we have a trading source, it is a fresh new day, and this didn't work. Thank goodness there's no mobs. All right. Let's drink a potion and go find, there's one right there. Let's see, will you buy my wheat? at the ready. Hello, sir. 
the sounds these guys make are so cool. What book? Show me the book. Oh no, drown. <laughs> Ooh, that scared me. They really did. They really startled me. Ooh, he dropped a nugget, a gold ingot, I mean. All right, so maybe we'll try another. Do you have, sir? Ooh, bricks for nuggets. Bricks for nuggets. I will buy two of those. Thank you very much, because I was like, how am I going to make flower pots? Let's see, does anyone want to buy my wheat? Will you buy my wheat? No, you won't buy my wheat. Ooh, there's more over here. You will buy my wheat. 20. Ooh, that's not going to make it that much. Okay, let's see. What else? Pumpkin pie. And cake. I would love to buy it if I had oodles. If I had oodles, I would definitely buy more. Let's see. Sixteen. Oops. Excuse me, dude. What do you sell? Hello, sir. Leather. I'm not interested in the leather. Come on, give me something good. Ooh, I wonder if they do the that thing. Or if you hold the nugget. No, they don't do it. You know, that's a new thing with the traders, with the uh, villagers, that they'll hold out whatever they're selling if you hold an emerald in your hand. Or if you hold something that they are selling, they'll hold an emerald in their hand. It's pretty neat. All right, but what kind of sword is this? Oh, I can't buy it. I have to level him up. Hello. What do you sell? I like your eye patch, dude. Ooh, this guy sells everything. We're going to buy two of those. And I don't have enough for anything else. You know what? Five of those, because then we can make a helmet. Yes. Thank you so much. What else do we need? Ooh. Another potion. I wonder if... Oh, no. We need a book for that one guy, right? Is it this guy here? I think you were the one with the book, right? What kind of book? Feather falling. Again. We don't need the feather falling. The dolphins are going nuts. You look like a librarian. But you don't wait. Ooh, what's that? An empty map. No. Wait, this guy sells for emeralds. I don't have emeralds. Sorry, dude. Alright. I feel like I've traded with you before. No, I haven't. But you fish. You have the clay. Oh, he's gonna buy stone. 21? for a gold nugget. I, I'm sorry. That's just, just not worth it at all. There's so many. Ooh. Let's try the furthest. The holy smokes, there's so many. Check out you. String. Ooh. Wait, you sell arrows? Nine. I don't know if that's worth it. I don't know if that's worth it. What about you? Play. Leather. Fish again. I think we're going to try to trip a couple more times and we'll save the third potion. We won't keep going. We're going to stop after you go. Ooh, what kind of book is this? 
show me the book. Why is it so hard to see the book? Quick Charge 3. I'm not interested in that. I keep saying last one in my head, last one. But they don't have that many good trades. I'm disappointed. Ooh, I could buy goggles from him. Wait, 19 gold nuggets for one gold nugget? Yo, you're a con artist, buddy. Oh! Tell him to get out of here. I'm gonna die. Yep. Tell him to go. Dude had a trident. Ooh, I wonder if we could see that last... The last creature. Where is my house? Oh, perfect timing. My potion just wore off. And it's raining. And the fish. I think it's supposed to be over here. Let's see if I can make something under my house. Okay, so I'm going to call it quits there for today. We finished putting, oh, well, we put a lot of dirt down today. We got some gold nuggets to go trade with villagers, and we did. It was, it was fairly decent. We got some stuff. Um, I think next time that we come back, I'm going to actually have the farm done. So that's what I'm going to do meantime maybe some more dirt around the island and all that sweet jazz so next time next time next time i'll uh I'll get a bunch more stuff done i hope you enjoyed our i hope you enjoyed our little adventure today under the water and check out some villager trades that was pretty neat those villagers are so cool they sound so cool they're they're goofy looking. The, the uh, trades are a little pricey, a little different. No one's, they're all scatterbrained. No one has uh, the appearance of what they're trading for, in my opinion. <laughs> but that's cool. And we're going to leave it here. We'll see you next time. All right? Leave a like. Please leave a like. <laughs> Comment. Subscribe. Notifications? Yes, the works. Thank you so much. And we will see you. I will see you next time. <laughs>